For the first time in 33 years, the Belmont Bruins will be led by a coach other than Rick Bird. But it won't be too much of a culture shock for fans and players, as Casey Alexander spent 20 years under Bird, first as a player, and then as assistant coach. You know, but I'm inheriting a team and a program that uh, is used to winning a lot of games and had great success and does things the right way. So I'm really privileged and honored to be a part of that. Alexander did inherit a team with a ton of talent, but is left with only two seniors to help lead these young players. Senior Seth Allisberger knows how important it is for him and Michael Benkert to step up as leaders. One thing for Mike and I is just being more vocal. We're both guys who can, I think, can just kind of put our heads down a lot of times and, and get through it. But a lot of that's also learning to be more vocal and be the senior leader who says, hey, we're going to get through this. Hey, we're, you know, we're messing up right now. We need to do better. And so I think it's been a learning experience for both of us in getting better with doing that. Though the team may be young, it still has a lot of talent, especially from OVC Freshman of the Year, Nick Musinski. Moose, as his teammates and fans refer to him, averaged 14.7 points per game and 5.8 rebounds in his freshman season. As he looks ahead to this year, Alexander knows how important it will be for Musinski to continue to grow and improve. You know, I think the key for him is just um, take the next step. You know, I mean, player development is so important. Whether you're the best player or not, whether you're a starter or not, you know, I mean, it's uh, you go from one season to the next, and it's important to work on your game and find ways to improve. And if each player can improve, then the team improves, and you can keep getting better. The Bruins will be relying on the sophomore a lot this year to be one of the team's top scorers. But Musinski just wants to win, no matter who's putting the ball in the basket. Um, I think our team is like more than maybe any other team in the country. We are just a balanced offensive unit. You know, nobody really cares who scores 20, who scores zero. I mean, I'll tell you right now, if you could guarantee us that, guarantee me we go 30 whatever and 0, and I scored zero points all year, I would take that in a heartbeat. Even with a coaching change and an extremely young team, fans should expect to see a Belmont team that looks similar in years past. One that will continue a legacy of excellence in the Alexander era. I said, you know, one, one thing about Belmont and what, what people should expect is that, you know, the more things change, the more they stay the same. Uh, I'm a different guy. It's, a new, it's maybe a new era in some ways, but, but I will stay true to what Belmont is and what this program has stood for and um, what's made it great.